Good morning, guys. Hey, Jenna Rich here. How's it going? Hey, I'm testing the abilities of our new GoPro. Uh, it, it has a media mod on it, which includes a shotgun microphone. So I'm seeing how well it sounds here in the wind today. It is windy. For those of you who aren't in Las Vegas, check it out. It is totally blown over today. In fact, what we have is a situation where in California, they were apparently they were having a gender reveal party, which I I, I thought that was like a transgender thing where someone's coming out of the Jed Joy explained to me that just when they have a party to tell people when or what sex the baby's gonna be that they just had. So the fire got fired off, and what happened is, as you can see, is that all the smoke has created, well, it's kind of like an inversion here. So we have this really strong winds that are coming through here. They're actually very cool today. Just a few days ago, it was 114 degrees. I think that was, uh, yeah, two days ago. I'm not sure what the tie is today, but it's significantly cooler today. That's a 40 degree change in two days. Largely due to this, probably this inversion, or I don't know, but it's definitely affected our climate here. So, the air quality, I imagine, is not good. Um, so wear your mask, whether you believe in the coronavirus or not, because there is a lot of dust and a lot of smoke in the air. It can't be good if you have respiratory issues. So, keep that in mind, you guys. Um, I'm gonna head back inside. The birds are having their, having their breakfast, I'm sure. And hey, 22 days, and we're out of here. So please continue watching, subscribe, follow us to uh, Panama, follow us to our next adventure. We're 600 hours and eight minutes right now. Thanks guys for watching. Oh. Hello? Yeah, I need to come back. Okay, I'm coming back. So one of our subscribers who lives in Vegas, you're gonna have to take over for the Jedi after we go. And all you gotta do is just, I don't know, just do whatever they ask you to do. While the Jedi are in Panama. And you will be, be rewarded immensely and abundantly. Grabbing this guy here out of the studio. I needed to grab my uh, the new XS here. Jedi Joy Rich Show in Vegas right now. We're getting ready to move to Pam off of these going to watch them. So this is our new XS Max. It's now got it in a tripod. Okay. So I have. So this GoPro thing has a nice little light on here. This one, so I'm filming you right now. See, so I got this one filming you right now, and then I got this one over here, the light on backwards, filming me. So now we're gonna go outside, check out what's going on. So, check it out. Sun's starting to come out, but we got real strong, blustery winds. Uh, that's most likely due to the uh, fire that is going on in California right now. So a little bit, we're gonna hang out. The babies are gonna come out. We're gonna put... Here are the two side-by-side -side selfie cams. So I can't see the GoPro because it doesn't have a video monitor on it. That was an accessory. They said it would be ready in August. Well, it's September 7th and they haven't emailed me yet. And it's not on their website. So hold on, let me fix my hat, guys. It's blustery out here. I don't want to lose my shorts or my hat. So come on. Woo. So this is already starting to feel like the tropics. Just so you know, here, right here in Vegas. <coughs> Shh. 
See the clouds are kind of rushing in there. Ah, oh. you know I love Vegas. I love the desert. I learned so much here. It was really, really, quite honestly, what makes a place. And this is what we were trying to explain to people here in Vegas. It's not the buildings. It's not the football team. It's not all that stuff. It's not all the good maybe the football team, but but for the most part. We don't know about the football team because that's new. But for the most part, what makes Vegas Vegas is the people. So why come to Vegas? Because of people. But you know what? You're gonna fall over. Gotcha. So you know. In about 40 days and 40 nights, <laughs> what's going to happen is there's going to be a mass exodus out of the desert. Over 350,000 people are facing eviction. That's a lot because the state only has like what? Three million total, maybe less than three million. So, if more than ten percent of the people are leaving, like fifteen percent of people are basically being evicted, they're probably going to either stay here or leave. I imagine they're going to probably go a place where they can get some money. All sorts of things are going on. You know, he's still out here. You know, that guy over here every morning. Doing his exercise, he's not deterred by the fire at all. Ooh, man! Excuse me, it's getting blustery now. Wow, I got something in my eye. Hold on. Yeah, so you know, I mean, what's going to happen? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. That's what I think everyone's trying to figure out right now. What's going to happen to Las Vegas? And what's going to happen to the people living here? Shout out to my man Kelly Kwame, we on top, shout out, shout out, check it out. Check it out. 